Q here. Welcome to the channel if you found it. We have the sun, the happiest card in the deck, shining out its illuminating goodness as we see all the options that we have in front of us. So let's cut here and dive into this Tree of Life Kabbalah reading here as we have now. Ten cups on the bottom, so we're dreaming big as our crown is mm, heavy from the heartache, but we're putting it to low with the wisdom of crashing down shabby foundations and understanding that we need to see new ways, new portals of operation. The mercy of being able to experience and douse out the growth and meaning from this transformation of the severity of death there into the beautiful center that moves you to a new soul contract. We go into the victory of the Ace of Wands there. The Eight of Cups of walking away from that getting to our foundation of a new pathway and our kingdom of being nurtured by the queen of pentacles hmm i like it so from our heartache we end up nurturing and healing not only ourselves but others hmm. walking away from the death and into a new portal a new passionate beginning from traditionally despair from a tower. I don't know why, but I feel like you take this tower down because you just see that it's shoddy foundation. Hmm, interesting. Two cups, two wands as we go through the new doors there and transcend the heartache of three swords. Boom. Cups come in. They got ten cups to fill there. <laughs> and six uh, pentacles there, that miracle energy. I would say that's a miracle there. So, Knight of Cups is coming in to bring that miracle or that dreams that you've been dreaming big of. So if in a dark space, Q's got you, but I'm going to immediately jump into our chakra side of this. Hmm. Hey everybody, it's Q here. Welcome to the channel. If you found it, we got Justice on the bottom and Glacia bringing those eight wands of swift action. So we're going to jump into the Kabbalah's... Um, chakra side here. Justice wanted to jump out, so I won't argue with that. <laughs> and we'll go walk away from that as seven swords of heartache and pain and th thievery in the night affects our sh root chakra. Mm. Sexual energy, a tower and new possibilities as we have the courage to move towards it, experience it. Mm, our wants and desires is despair and death. <laughs> our five cups into death. So we're turning in a new direction there with the seven pentacles to two cups as morning star energy revitalizes everything, gives it new meaning in our heart there. Mm. Throat chakra of walking away and a passionate new beginning is agreed upon with bossing up, being grounded, stable with the king of pentacles there. Mm -hmm. um, our third eye is opening the doors of a new perception from the disappointment. We know what we now need to look for and what we don't want to look for as the world opens up for our crown chakra as we are nurtured and want to go nurture others. I would say that's harmonized and balanced with justice there and something worth walking towards with the eight cups. Queen of cups, plenty of love to get out. A knight of swords coming in quickly. Oh yeah, out of the cold to step in our destiny there. Boom. And boom, two cups again shows up as a split. I like it. Beautiful reading there with the symmetry and adult yourself with this energy here. And if you're in a dark space, Q's got you.